everyone. It is now 11.45 on Thursday night. I want to go ahead and do my DIY video um, to let you know um, some things that I got to um, from some of them from the Dollar Tree and a couple of things I got from Hobby Lobby. And um, yeah, but before I start, please like, comment, and subscribe and just let me know what you think. Share um, my video. Yeah. Show me a little support. Okay, let's get started. Okay. Okay. As you know, in my haul, I got the glue dots. Um, and it's for, you know, like permanent hole things that you want to you know, put up and have a little permanent hole. So what I did was I used this with the stickers that I got. And also, um, well, this this um, canvas is from Michaels. But I put the stickers, I painted this with some paint that I got from Michaels and um, used these little glue dots to put my letters on that I got today um, from Hobby Lobby and I just did my name on there and just put the stickers on the board after the board dried from the paint and I'm going to hang this up on the wall and I think it's just a little cute little simple project um, these were actually um, $3.99 a piece, but they were half price, so I only paid like $2 a letter. And the stickers, you, as you know, were a dollar <laughs> from the Dollar Tree. So, I have that. Okay. And I did do these little trays over again i added some more wine glass to have it uh, more sturdy and i added some more glue to make it make sure they you know stuck together so this is the tray you could actually use it as a serving dish like put a little you know put some little dip and chips on it or you could just use it as a little arrangement for the middle or your, of your table. Put a little flower arrangement on top. And this is um, Dollar Tree things that I got and, you know, did the shelves and everything on here, a dollar a piece. So, you know, so I think this is a good little project that you could, you know, do a little simple little arrangement and down here okay and this is the other one because I had two of these and I had an extra tray that I needed to do and like I said um, on these the shells are different And I know you're wondering why I did the um, wine glasses on the bottom. The reason I did that is because I wanted it to have a sturdiness. So I had to add more glasses to um, the bottom of the tray. And um, as you know, the, the um, stones on here are from the Dollar Tree. And there are stones inside them. Let me see if I can show it to you in the middle. So, yeah. And I know it's a different um, type of project. It's, you know, different, unique, but I like different and unique stuff. So the last one that I did, I didn't do the stones on it. I just put the shells in the middle um, of the glass. 
in the middle. So, and you know, as you can see, the shells are around there. So yeah. So you can use it for whatever you you could put your little bowl with dip, um, just to you know have a little cuteness when you you're serving at a party. Um, a little bowl with some dips on it, and or bowls or containers, um, whatever you want to call it, and um, you know serve some things. And then you could you know also get those little liners to put in the tray to put like nuts and or you know, whatever, cold cuts or whatever you want to put on it. It's just a little, um, to make it a little bit more cute, you know, without being expensive or anything. And also, my son is into the music um, thing, making beats and things, so... What I did was I went and got this from Hobby Lobby today, and it was also half price. Um, I think it was, it may have been $5, I'm not sure. But I just got some old DVDs and um, CDs and put it on a picture frame, <laughs> an old picture frame. Um, one that the glass had broken out of it and um, I just figured out a way to put the frame to some use um, without, you know, being too expensive. And I just added that on there. So we're going to put this on the wall in his room. And I think it's a cute little, um, a cute little symbol of music and, you know, I think he'll like it. Cheap, because it's old. Um, these CDs were scratched up or something that we don't look at or listen to or whatever. Um, and we just, um, instead of throwing them away, we, I just, you know, put them on this picture frame, this old picture frame. And I use the glue sticks um, from the, from, no, from Michael's. And, um, just got those little attachments and attach this on here. Um, and we're just going to put this in his room on his wall to represent his love for music. So. I think that is it. So. My favorite project is this one because um, as many of you know, I am a two-time breast cancer survivor. And um, I didn't know what else to do with these stickers. And um, so this came to mind. What I did was put some of those little glitter, the little glitter glue on it. I glue with paint on it. And I don't know if you can see it um, on there. Um, I put it on the, the letters. And um, you can barely see it on the screen, but... And then I just added, after I painted the canvas, I just added the stickers and the letters to the, to to it and, you know, with these little glue dots. So, yeah, well, I'm going to hang this up probably in my room. So I think, you know, I am, like I said, I am getting into the arts craft. Uh, arts and craft things and do it DIYs and this is just very fun for me right now and um, on this um, just to make it a cute design you could just I don't know if you I think you can see it. Um, just make it a cute little design and just stack them up like that. Stack them up like that and just, you know, just have it like as a little, um, kind of looking like a, a tier of wine glasses just for decoration. Um, you can just do whatever you want to with it. Um, it's just an idea that I came up with. Um, 
not the best, but I think, you know, it's kind of cute for what I was working with. So, yeah, so um, what I'm doing now is just um, just putting my medicine bones and, you know, stuff on it. And that's what I'm doing with the frames now. Um, but they can be used. You can put a little tray liner on it and you can little stir little things. Um, or just have it like in a in, on a table just set up. But you know, so people can serve themselves, um, their poor chips or whatever. Um, as long as you you know, line it with the, the liner, you know. I think it is a cute little this is my salt now, y'all know I got from um um, TJ Maxx. And, you know, I still love my little flower arrangement. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I do think that's a lot of my DIY type of stuff that's always over here in the corner. So, don't think I'm just, you know, <laughs> having junk everywhere. It's just stored there for the meantime. So, just let me know what you think of my little DIYs, and um, I'm hopefully, I hopefully I'll come up with something else that's more <laughs> um, technical or more, you know, just better. <laughs> um, but I just, this is the little stuff that I had. And I just want to go ahead and share that with you. Um, so, yeah, just let me know what you think about this DIY project that I did. And um, maybe give me some ideas on how to perfect my skill on the DIY tip. <laughs> and God loves you. And I do too. And there's nothing you can do about it. Have a great rest of your week well weekend because tomorrow is friday so you know that's the beginning of the weekend so i hope you enjoy and just stay encouraged no matter what you're going through i know um floridians or you know kind of scared about the weather you know getting bad there but just know that whatever um you're going through whatever you're stressing about. Just leave it in God's hand because um, God can take care of it way better than you can stressing about it. So just stay encouraged, be uplifted, and take heed to the warnings. When they say get out, please get out and get safe. Love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>